Hello and welcome to this learning video. In this learning video, we are going to take one deadly example where it seems like it is a problem of even and odd and uh, students end up with finding out either A0 and AN or only BN. But the problem demands all the Fourier coefficients that you have to find out. Let's see what this problem is. So this problem says find the Fourier series for f of x is equal to x minus x square in the interval minus 1 to 1. Now whenever you have the interval minus a to a here a is equal to 1 just take for the uh, function whether the function is even or odd. So my function f of x is equal to x minus x square. So when I replace x by minus x this is minus of x minus of minus x square so this is minus x minus x square which is not equal to f of x not even equal to minus f of x okay so this problem given problem is neither even nor odd meaning thereby in this problem to get the Fourier series for this uh, function x minus x square, you have to not only find out a0 and an, but bn also you have to find out. Okay, so let us see this problem. So the given function is neither even nor odd. So write down the Fourier series. Okay, so here you can write let f of x is equal to x minus x square okay minus 1 less than x less than 1 fine therefore f of x is equal to a0 by 2 plus summation n is equal to 1 to infinity a n cos n pi x by l so cos n pi x l is 1 plus b n sin n pi x okay a n cos n pi x plus b n sin n pi x say this is to be my equation 1 this is to be my equation 2 b the required series b the required Fourier series okay so where where what is a0 where a0 is 2 by 1 integration 0 to 1 right let me check this it's not this uh, because this is not even function so we cannot write like this okay so we just have to write a0 is 1 by 1 integration minus 1 to 1 f of x dx what is a n a n is 1 by 1 integration minus 1 to 1 f of x into cos n by x dx and b n is equal to 1 by 1 integration minus 1 to 1 f of x into sine n pi x dx okay so what you are waiting for then find out a0 a n and b n so to find to find a0 what is my a0 find a0 is equal to integration minus 1 to 1 f of x that is x minus x square dx okay <clears throat> so this is integration of x square by 2 minus x cube by 3 minus 1 to 1 so this is 1 by 2 minus 1 by 3 minus of 1 by 2 plus 1 by 3 okay so this is minus 2 by 3 so this plus 1 by 2 minus 1 by 2 cancel minus 1 by 3 minus 1 by 3 so a0 is equal to minus 2 by 3 so i am getting this to be minus 2 by 3 is it okay now after a0 
let us find out a n so this is my a n <coughs> to find a n a n is equal to minus 1 to 1 f of x is this into cos n pi x d x so this a n is equal to integration of this uh, so you can do one thing or here uh, okay apply the integration by parts to this so this is first function x minus x square integration of cos is sine n pi x upon coefficient of x n pi limit minus 1 to 1 minus derivative of this so this is 1 minus 2x derivative or oh, sorry integration of this so this is minus cos n pi x upon coefficient of x already n pi and n pi so this is n pi square limit minus 1 to 1 plus derivative of this so this is minus 2 integration of this so this is minus sine n pi x upon n pi q limit minus 1 to 1 and this completes the integration okay now solve this further <coughs> now as you can see here 1 minus 1 so upper limit will give you 0 then lower limit minus 1 minus 1 minus 2 but here sin n pi will give you 0 so this is 0 minus 0 this is <coughs> minus minus plus 1 upon n square pi square okay 1 upon n square pi square apply here the limit so 1 upon n square pi square x is equal to 1 so 1 minus 2 so this is minus 1 into cos cos n pi is it yes minus put x is equal to minus 1 so minus minus plus so 1 minus minus plus 1 plus 2 3 cos of minus n pi cos n pi is minus 1 to the power n so this is also my cos cos minus n pi is also cos n pi okay one minus two is minus one into cos n pi this is also cos n pi okay minus two into sin n pi is zero sin n pi is zero okay <coughs> So this is 0 last term. So we remain with only this minus 1 minus 3 is minus 4. Okay. <clears throat> so this is a n is equal to n square pi square minus 1 minus 3 minus 4. So this is minus 4 into cos n pi. What is cos n pi? Cos n pi is minus 1 to the power n. Or you can write this one as a n is equal to 4 into minus 1 to the power n plus 1 upon n square pi square by applying the law of indices to this. Okay. This is my a n. Now find out b n. Oh goodness. Okay. I am finding here only b n. So to find b n, b n is this. Instead of cos there would be a sign. This is x minus x square integration of sine is minus cos. So this is minus cos. Then this minus minus cos minus sine n pi x. <coughs> okay. And then minus sine is minus cos. So this minus minus become plus. 
only change is this okay now i want you to pause the video for a minute and uh, try to get this b in by applying the limits and then resume the video so i hope you might have uh, get the value of b1 so let us cross check now Let's cross check the values. So I am getting a n. Uh, a n is stay. So a n is four minus one to the power n plus one upon n square pi square. This is the value of a n I am getting. Now finding b n. Okay, this is b n. So what is b n? Here, when you apply the limits, this is one minus one zero. So upper limit will give you zero, minus lower limit. So this minus and minus become plus. So minus one, minus one. So this is minus two upon n pi, minus two upon n pi. Okay, cos n pi. This is the first one. Minus the second limit is sine n pi or sine of minus n pi, so this will give you zero minus zero minus two upon n cube pi cube. Okay, this will give you cos n pi minus cos of minus n pi. So that would be zero, is it? Cos n pi minus cos n pi is zero. So here we will be getting b n to be this minus two upon n pi minus one to the power n, or you can write this one as b n is equal to two into minus one to the power n plus one upon n pi. So these are the values that I am getting. Okay, now at last you just have to substitute the values of a zero. A n and B n, okay, in the equation number two. So let me rub this now. Then equation two becomes equation two becomes what is it? Equation two f of x. What is f of x? This. f of x is x minus x square is equal to a zero by two. What is a zero? This means minus two by three by two. So this get cancel minus one by three. Plus summation n is equal to one to infinity a n. What is my a n? My a n is this four into minus one to the power n plus one upon n square pi square into Cos into what? Cos n pi x plus b n. What is b n? B n is this two minus one to the power n plus one upon n pi into sine n pi x. Okay, this is the required solution. Uh, at the most, what you can do? At the most, you can just take out the terms outside the summation. Okay, so that is x minus x square is equal to minus one by three plus summation over n. So I can take two uh, by pi. I can take common. Okay, or if you want, I can take four by pi and giving summation to. These terms also, so I can take four by pi square into summation n is equal to one to infinity minus one to the power n plus one upon n square into cos n by x plus here I can take two by pi outside and I can write summation n is equal to one to infinity minus one to the power n plus one. Upon n sine n pi x, and this is the required Fourier series for the given function x minus x square in the interval 
minus 1 to 1. So if the function is neither even nor odd, don't try to make it odd function or even function and don't just find only a0 and an or bn. Instead, if the function is neither even nor odd, you have to find out a0, an, bn, all these Fourier coefficients and substitute in the required Fourier series to get the desired result. Okay, so thank you for watching this learning video and enjoy learning mathematics. Thank you.